Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Argentina versus France. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The Argentina first team. Well, when they don't have possession, it will be a back five. But when they win the ball back, the wing backs will push further forward to make it a 3 5 2. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. Kylian Mbappe plays with Usman Dembele in the wide positions. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. And so the battle commences. McAllister, Enzo Fernandez, Nahuel Molina, Messi, splendid defending and it needed to be. Aurelien Chouameni, Lionel Messi's daredevil style of attacking could well make the difference here, Stuart. Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. Messi. Messi. Fluency of movement. Really vital interception here. Well, France are the holders. Not too many people doubted them coming into the tournament. And quite frankly, they've rubber-stamped their credentials. So watertight at the back, fluent in midfield, fearsome in attack. Can they be stopped? I'm not sure they can, Derek. I think they've been outstanding. They've done everything we expected. Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score! And it's in! We've just witnessed the first goal of this 2022 World Cup final. One to save Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding. And what an emphatic strike it is from Lionel Messi. Hit with his laces, it's a great goal. And France gets the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? Alvarez. Might be able to set up the chance. It's a neat move. Oh, good work by the keeper. He's got the right idea with that pass. Oh, magnificent reaction.
Mateo Hernandez. Radio. Griezmann gets himself into the attacking third with the ball at his feet. But they took care of the situation defensively. Alvarez. De Paul. Messi. Chances on. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. to go short promising possession this well not on the target the keeper seemed to have it covered well he did seem to have it covered but it's not a bad effort though he really did strike it well Olivier Giroud Dembele on the ball and he takes it on oh really good reflexes and danger averted another short corner here Belly with the cross. Oh, a goal it is! The equaliser in this final. What next in the drama? Well, here's the replay, and it's a well-worked corner. They go short, change the angle, and then put the ball into the box. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Marcos Acuna. Good technique displayed. Messi. Superb block. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Kylian Mbappe. Teo Hernandez now. Rabio. Promising move this from France. Mbappe! Oh, it's in! They're in front here. Now can they stay in front? Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. Kick off again. 2-1 the current state of affairs. Alvarez. Here's Marcos Acuna. A creative look about this. How can they create something? Well, the goal was at his mercy. Well, it certainly was. He has to score there. Well, there it is. France just haven't had as much of the ball. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. And the flag has been raised here. 
Well, there can't have been a lot in that. Physically strong and secure on the ball. Oh, but they've lost it now. So two minutes to be added on at the end. And a good-looking ball. Rabio. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. So they get the ball rolling once more, and it's advantage France after the first half. Let's see what the second 45 has in store for us. Mbappe, and the cross not quite imaginative enough. Dembele. Can't miss, surely! Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. <laughs> Playing it in. It might still be problematic. Rabio. And he read it well, intercepting it. Can he find the right pass? Mbappe, can he finish this? And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, let's take another look at the replay. What a through ball this is by Mbappe. And Koeman couldn't hit this any better. What a great finish this is. So back underway at 3-1. Alexis McAllister. Messi. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Griezmann! Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, what a magnificent save that was. It really was top-class goalkeeping. Enzo Fernandez. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. And the keeper taking care of the situation. unable to keep the ball teammates available determined block Giroud Mbappe with it Teo Hernandez Mbappe making sure nothing came of it Martinez on to Messi Lisandro Martinez now they're on the scent of something positive and credit is due for that good piece of defending now can they counter clinically Mbappe might it be Mbappe and a good take under duress there McAllister 
No space for them here. Interception to snuff out the danger. Olivier Giroud. Well, very effective play in possession. Hernandez. And Giroud waits to fire. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Coman. Can they keep it out? And a time for calm on the ball. Messi. Martinez. Messi. Can he take advantage? Just cleared away in the nick of time. Martinez. He has time to play it over. And the danger is still there. Well, the supporters think it's on. Lionel Messi. Able to get a body in the way. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Lisandro Martinez. And the counter looks on here. Options available. All hands on deck. And that break looked so uh, promising, but nothing coming from it. Rodrigo de Paul. Messi. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Let's see if something comes of this. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. And now it's all over. France are world champions for the third time. And there's no doubt about it, Derek. They've been the best team in the tournament. the world champions it takes a massive effort to win back-to-back -back world cups but Stuart that's what France have done and they fully deserve it as well they've been excellent throughout the tournament the coach has done the right things they've had a good team spirit and just think of those fans they've got right behind this team brilliant for them